Good morning, everybody. What is going on? Day three of Corona isolation. And we're going to go through today what we're doing. Ashley's currently making breakfast. This is what happens every morning. Mmm, pancakes. So these pancakes are actually oat based, so they're super healthy and super cheap to make. Um, and especially since we could be on rations, then yeah, it's a good alternative to oats or anything else you can make with oats. Um, we have oats most days, so yeah, mixing it up a bit. Lucky I gave him the choice, I said, do you want oats or pancakes? And straight away, of course, he said pancakes, so pancakes it is. It's pretty much a restaurant here in the van. Here you go, Lockie. Here's your breakfast. You can see Lockie's sneaking whip. Don't! Sorry. He sneaks the whipped cream. This is why he has a problem and it needs to be gone, eaten and gone from the fridge. So I finished my little workout. I've had a bit of a sponge bath. So I've put on some fresh clothes so I'm not stinky and sweaty. And I'm just going for a little walk um, just to the supermarket to hopefully get some fresh bread or rolls or something for lunch. Um, it's about a 15 minute walk from where we're staying. Um, so it's not too bad. Um, and it shouldn't be chaotic, but I mean, hopefully I'll be able to show you guys anyway. As you can see, town seems pretty quiet again. No real change since yesterday. Okay, so we're just approaching the supermarket now. Can't really see many cars there at all. It's a really nice day. I've just taken off my jumper. It was a bit windy earlier, but the weather's just amazing here at the moment. So it doesn't feel like, you know, this bad thing is happening and everyone should be panicked because the weather's just so nice out that everyone's just out enjoying the sun. So you make the most of it, I guess. But if you see here, here's the car park. But as you can see, the supermarket shelves are not bare at all. There's plenty of food. No one is panicking. Okay, so I'm just finishing grocery shopping and that was totally pain free. No one is panicking. There's food on the shelves. Nothing is running low. Um, so yeah, it, it's good to know that we don't have to hoard food like, you know, other countries, as in particular Australia are doing. Um, and everyone's just going about their day and just being really cautious and not going out unless they have to. Um, so yeah, they're not panicking over food and so we'll be fine. It's all good. So I'm just showing you guys now. This is kind of the little community village um, that the place we're staying in at the moment is in. And they're all like typical old Austrian homes um, that have been beautifully done up and preserved. Um, Dietz was actually telling us uh, yesterday that um, the house that they actually live in used to you know, is dated back and back and back with his family and it used to be one of the first old foresters home and it dates back to like the 1700s. So crazy amount of history here, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, it's a really cool experience, I guess, to live up in the mountains in a, in a place like this. There's definitely no shortage of food here. We will not starve. What you got there? Oh, he mm. made you that lovely, healthy sandwich. I made it myself. You did not. He's a liar. I did. Life's tough. We're just listening to some Triple J. Had lunch. Now we're just sitting in the sun having a coffee. Yeah. <laughs> Lockie's got his guns out, trying to get some sun. Because we pasty little Australians haven't seen the sun in four months. <laughs> it's just like going camping, really. Like yeah. Just sitting there listening to music, enjoying nature, you know, in the woods sort of thing. It's like a good sort of camping. Chilling, chilling out, out. Yeah. doing whatever you want to do, relaxing, have a nap. Yeah, relaxing. Triple J's Go with the All right, so Lockie has decided this afternoon that he's going to get fit and he's going to go for a run. So 
I've decided that we're going to go with him for emotional support. Thanks. So we're just starting out with a bit of a slow, gentle pace. What are you talking about? This is pretty <laughs> Come on, Lucky, you can do it. Bit of an incline up this hill. How are we doing? Oh, fuck. You can do it. Keep running. We got to go back. Downhill now. Let's go. We're almost back. Tommy is inside. I think I'm having a heart attack. Come on, people though. Come on, we've got this. Alright, we've just got back. Lucky, how did you do? I'm ready to die. My heart's beating like it's never beat before. Tonight we are having ginger, honey ginger salmon. How long are we thinking about taking? The people want <laughs> oh, to know. Sorry. Um, sorry, if you could let the customers know that there's about a 10 minute wait on food here. Due to Corona or just? We're just really busy and we've only got two burners working. This yeah. is outrageous. Anyway guys, thank you for joining us for another day. Uh, so we're just gonna have a quiet night tonight again because we can't go anywhere, we can't do anything. So join us tomorrow for another fun filled episode of the Corona Isolation Vlog. Ciao, ciao for now.